this box right here alone, which is actually really heavy, that's why it's on a stool, uh, was kind of enough. Welcome back, it is me, Drew, and today's video that I have for you. Um, first of all, this is like probably going to be one of my longest videos ever, like longer even than like the video where I was like, I'm having plastic surgery or any of those videos. Because this video, um, I put up a little survey on Instagram today, and um, I basically asked like, would you guys like me to make a video of me showing you all of the actual face masks that I own? And like 75% yes on that, as well as I know like on YouTube, you guys have kind of asked and alluded to wanting me to make a video like this before. So um, I'm not doing a face mask tonight only because it kind of would be too hard to like talk and go through this box with a face mask on. But if you want to do a face mask with me while I show you all of my face masks, Feel free. So, um, if you're brand new to my YouTube channel, hi, welcome, I'm Drew. I am a face mask junkie. Um, yeah, so if you're a regular here, you already know what's up. Um, if you want to be part of the Just Like Drew crew and you're not already, click the red subscribe button down below this video. Join our forever family. We are literally the best crew because anybody and everybody can be in our crew. Okay, so, um, I don't even know where to begin. I do want to say I'm only doing my box of sheet masks. I actually have a drawer in my dresser that is all like not sheet mask it's like liquid mask peel off mask clay mask all that so I suppose if you're like I want to know what all that stuff is too I can make a part two to this video but I felt like just this box right here alone which is actually really heavy that's why it's on a stool uh, was kind of enough so um, I'm just gonna get I'm just gonna get into this since I've already spent like two minutes not talking about face masks so I'm gonna be showing you my box of sheet masks what I have here um, and I think I've talked about this before like where I have like the good side of masks and I have like the the like ooh side of masks like when somebody's over and they have no idea what sheet masks are and they're just kinda like I wanna try a sheet mask and you're like you know what you can just Pick, you don't care actually about any of this and you're just doing it for fun. Feel free to pick from, from this side. I know that's messed up, but I'm gonna keep it real. But recently, this side is pretty much, for the most part, just as good as this side. So I kind of have like two good sides of face masks and this is more of like the double side. Okay, anyways, so starting off at the front here, I have my uh, bunny ears that I've gotten um, from BioBell Cosmetics. I don't actually know how to put these on. Like we've talked about this before. Um, I got these and I'm like, I don't actually know. I think you're supposed to like, I think this is how it works. I'm not even sure. I've never successfully done these yet though. Do I have these on right? I don't know. See, I have two pairs of these bunny ears that I don't actually know how to wear. They're really cute. I wish I knew how to wear them, but I don't. Um, I'm actually gonna start with the masks that I guess are kind of like the okay masks, not like the best, whatever. And then I'm gonna get into like all of the really cool masks. So on the top here, um, you'll notice I have multiples of a lot of things too. Oh, this isn't even a sheet mask. I have this hydration recovery aerating gel mask from this brand called Lumien. Uh-oh, we're gonna have trouble today with the focusing. This is gonna be a long video just from getting everything to focus. I don't even know what that is. I think I got it in one of my subscription boxes. So I have four of these. These are the Saint Tropaz. These are like the tanning, um, self-tan sheet masks. You put these on and like I guess it tans your skin. I don't actually know why I have this because I have tan skin naturally, but well, I do know why because they were on clearance at like TJ Maxx or something for like a dollar. So I have four of these. These are normally like six bucks, four or six bucks a piece. I don't know. So I have these because I have a problem, even though I'm naturally tan and I don't need them. I have them. Maybe I'll use them in the summertime just for fun one day, just to see what that's about. So those are masks that you use if you want to tan your skin. I have these, these are Mickey Mouse face masks. I um, believe, yeah, these are from Target. Um, got these mainly for like the girls. So like my kids like to do face masks once in a while um, and I'm all about promoting like good skincare hygiene habits. So whenever they want to do that, I like to keep some sheet masks in my box that are kid safe, kid friendly. So I have Mickey Mouse masks, which funny enough, they've never actually wanted to do them. These were like 90 cents each at like clearance at Target. 
Um, I have a bunch of the animal masks. So these are like two tiger ones and a penguin mask. So these masks, again, they're from Mask Bar. I get these for the kids. They're really fun for kids to do. Again, it's a good way to show kids how to promote like, promote, like moisturizing their skin and good skin care. Um, personally, I don't actually feel like they do very much for um, my skin. I feel like it's really great if you're ever trying to get like, you know, a young person, kid or a teenager into even caring about their skin, but I don't actually feel like it does too much for like adults. Not trying to throw shade. Just being honest, as you can see, I know face masks. So these aren't face masks. These, okay. I got these a long time ago. These are like called steaming eye masks. I, they came in like a big old pack of these. I don't even know where I got them. I just know that they don't work. So I got these and like, so you're supposed to put this on and supposedly like it self steams your eyes and supposed to make your eyes feel great. And it didn't work. So, I mean, maybe I'll try it again, but it didn't work whenever I did try it. So, I have those. They don't actually work. That's where we're at in life. Next thing that we have, this mask I was actually given to by Justin. I guess his brother gave this to him. It's from Japan. Um, it's supposed to be like a really crazy looking mask. Um, and it's called Pure Smile. I have no idea what it does. I'm afraid to use it, but probably one of these days I'll actually get to it. Um... And then this was a mask, a two-stepper that I got from TJ Maxx. Um, I think we got one of these before in like a phase three box. Maybe not this one specifically. But this is, um, it's pack time, 10 p.m. mask, like a late night soothing mask. I don't know. It's like a two-stepper. I don't actually know. I don't know. I guess it's just like one of those masks you just do when you're like running late, but you want to do a face mask. I'm not really sure. But I have that. Okay, so I'm going to put these back in this side. And then we're going to get into the like wow side of things so um i have this mask here um, i actually have another one on this side of the box and this is air lanic air lanic <laughs> this is supposed to be like okay this is like a butterfly sheet mask i got these i never actually did i have two of them so essentially what i think you're supposed to do is you like there's like a little syringe in here and you put it on and then you put it on and i think it's supposed to like super clean out your pores. Again, I actually don't know because I've never actually done it, but I have two of them. So there's that. So I think I'll do it one of these days, but yeah, where's strong butterfly, pore be surprised, carbonated water 10% to help your skin problems with stimulus. I don't know. So I have that. Um, next thing in here, um, this is an exfoliating cleansing pad from Lapkos. Um, it's Milk Feel. Um, this is actually really nice when you're going to be putting on, like, a moisturizing sheet mask. Um, uh, any, honestly, any kind of, like, deep treatment sheet mask, doing, like, a nice exfoliation first to make sure your skin is, like, really, like, cleared out of all of the drama before doing that. Um, next thing that we have is, this one is from Patology. It's a mood mask. It says, just let it go glow. Um, so I recently started trying a couple of patchology masks here and there. I do like them. Um, so this one has pear fruit, sea berry extract, and niacinamide. It's for like a glowing skin mask. Like I said, patchology, solid brand, so I thought I'd try this one out. Have not actually done this one before though. Next one that we have, I'm trying to scoot over here. I feel like I'm like here, but here. I don't know what to do. I've never done anything like this before. We have I Do Care. Um, it's Jumpstart Energizing Pomegranate Mask. I've done masks from this brand before. I have not specifically done this mask, but I will say that I do like this brand of skincare. You can buy their masks at like Ulta. Um, really fun little uh, face mask brand. Um, next is this mask. This is actually a newer brand of face mask. I haven't actually done any of theirs before. This is a rose gold mask from Pure Aura. I believe it's like a foil sheet mask. Um, like I said, it's a brand new sheet mask brand. They're really kind of new to the masking market, so I haven't actually tried them yet. So if you have tried them, let me know what you think of them. Um, but hopefully, eventually, one of these days soon, I will try them. Next, I have the Deer Packer Royal Black Tea and Black Rose Hydro Gel Mask. Okay, so these masks, um, they have this one, and then there's, um, like a different one that they have that's, like, the same hydrogel. I love, love, love these. These are really great for hydrating, purifying the skin. Like I said, Deer Packer, there's this one, there's another one that looks, like, just like this, but it's a different color. Both of those are fantabulous masks. Next, we have our Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mask, which I got in BoxyCharm last month. I have not done it yet. Helicopter Mom ended up signing up for BoxyCharm. She did it. She said it was really, really, like 
Fill, filled with moisture. So I'm assuming that means she liked it. I don't know. She like doesn't give me like solid reviews of skincare stuff. Like she'll be like, I liked it. I don't know. You know, whatever. It's always mixed with her. Next we have a mask. I just got this one in the mail. It's a brand new mask that starts selling at Sephora online only. So I'm really excited to try this one. Maybe I'll do it for our next face mask and chill video. Um, this is by the brand Saturday Skin. First of all, look at the packaging. If you already know, this is why I'm excited. First of all, the packaging. There's like baby clouds in there. Um, and it's Cotton Cloud Probiotic Power Mask. I don't even know. I don't even know what it does, but the packaging alone is like my baby. I feel like I don't ever want to do this because of the packaging, but I feel like I need to do it because of the packaging. That's my, that's my life. Most of the time when I'm picking a sheet mask, I'm like, I want to do it because the way it's packaged. I don't want to do it because I want to keep the package. That's where I go with things. Next, we have a 23 years old black Cavadol mask. So this is like a caviar face mask from the brand 23 years old, which um, I'm friends with this brand. I love, love, love this brand. If you've never tried 23 years old, you need to try them. Honestly, I feel like they're one of the best sheet mask companies on the market right now, not just because I've partnered with them before, but because of the fact that they are absolutely just just um, remarkable skincare. Um, if you're ever like, I don't know anything about sheet masks, but I want to get into a brand 23 years old, phenomenal brand. They're sold on Amazon. Check them out. Um, this is a caviar mask. I want to say this is one that cover all of your face. Got this one at Riley Rose actually on sale. Um, next, I have baby face injections from, I don't know if it's Bono right there. Um, got this one from Face 3. This one's really good for always illuminating your skin, making it look plump and glowy. Another one from Face 3 is the Rose Heart Deep Moisturizing Pink Milk Mask. This is a two-step mask so essentially you do the mask first and you put on the cream afterwards anything rose I love getting because rose helps clarify your skin if your skin is having like redness issues or tone issues rose is amazing for that helps to calm your skin um, really 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 great especially like when you are dealing with winter weather where it's like one minute your skin's like really dry the next minute it's overly hydrated rose is like yes okay next thing that we have this one is the Tammy Sense revitalizing all-in-one mask um, this is a face three mask this one's really good so it really is an all-in-one kind of like for like I need my skin to look a little bit tighter I need it to look glowy I need to feel moisturized this is a really good one for just all of that next one is called I love myself this one is from phase three I've never done this mask before so I have no idea what it does I want to say probably moisturizes um it's a makeup boosting mask actually apparently you do this one before makeup so okay cool um next this mask I love 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 this mask one of my favorite like skin tightening masks and I actually have been like holding off on it because I'm like I want to wait till I like have a fancy dinner to go to and then I'm gonna use this mask this is the I'm sorry for my skin black mud mask tightening um I love this mask. So seriously, you put it on. This is one of the sheet masks that you actually will end up rinsing off, though. Um, I love this mask because it really does, like, your skin. And it's just like, girl, hold it together. So this mask, one of my all-time favorites. I've gotten this more than one time. So I always feel like because I try so many sheet masks, I always love trying different masks. If I ever get it, like, more than once... It's a winner. Um, next, we have this No HJ Modeling Mask Chrysanthemum. I want to say this one is really good for, like, getting your skin to glow. It's another one I got from Face 3. Um, seaweed Silky Mask. This is a Face 3 mask, but also from the brand 23 years old. This one covers up your whole face except for, like, your nose, your nostril holes. Um, amazing, amazing mask. I know it's seaweed, so it kind of grosses people out, but honestly, like, your whole face, including your lips, is going to be so hydrated and dewy and just, like, ugh. Oh, amazing so I love this mask for that reason next we have this one okay so the next set here are all the ones I've gotten from my face three boxes so I'm not going to go into too much detail because first of all I haven't actually tried a lot of them before second of all I've unboxed them on my face three video so if you're like oh I really want to know check out my face three videos you can find out more about these masks specifically um, so this one is the Americano mask it's the three, three step t-zone mask um, next we have the sparkling wine sheet mask right here um, you guys are going to think like I never actually do face masks. So funny enough, I do some sort of skincare uh, face mask or whether it be like a clay mask or something like I do that about five times a week, um, five or six times a week. So ironically, I do sheet masks all the time. I just have like so many that it looks like I never do them. Um, the face tree, let's talk detox mask is one for obviously detoxing your face, helping your pores, all of that. The Bono Baji Milk Thistle Repair Mask is a really good one. I think for like kind of like soothing, repairing your skin. Again, one for this time of year when you have like winter weather just kind of like messing with your face um the next one is dr althea water glow skin renewal hydrogel mask this is the one that i've been holding on to because it looks really really good i remember when i unboxed this on face 3 i was like this one looks amazing so i'm kind of waiting a little bit because 
I want to say that for a special occasion. Um, we got the Chanel Pollutant Defending Mask right there. Um, I actually like anti-pollution masks, but I kind of like doing those ones more in the summertime. I feel like in the summer, you're out more, you're at barbecues, things like that. That's when your skin gets filled with more of the like pollution. In the wintertime, you ain't going nowhere. You're staying indoors, so you don't really need that one as much. Um, next, we have this Simply When Snow Song Mask. I've been saving this one because it's really pretty. Um, if you could actually see it. There you go. Um, it's just like got like snowflakes, and it's really cute cute. It's for illuminating dull looking skin. Um, also the brand when I really like them for sheet mask another solid brand. They can be a little bit pricey at times. I don't know. Next we have this probiotic mask. It's a three stepper right here. I want to say there's like an exfoliating. Um, yeah so there's like a toning pad. You do the actual mask and you put on the intensive cream afterwards. Masks like that are always great. I always say use those when you have like a spe like if you don't have a lot of masks when you have a three step mask a good time is when you have like a special occasion a date or something like that where you really need your skin to be like like, yes queen that's always a good occasion for those next thing that we have is the face tree moon velvet moisturizing this is like a night mask I love the packaging for this I wanted to say like I think this is absolutely gorgeous cute packaging another one that I'm kind of like oh I want to use it but I want to keep the packaging you know how it goes um, the next one that we have is the DAF V7 Vita Pearl this is another three-step mask this one is more for whitening so people are always like why do you do a whitening mask okay so I don't specifically know the reason why they call things whitening. I personally think it's because they're trying to help the tonality of your skin and help it lighten and glow. So I guess they could just say lightening mask, but I suppose they don't want to say glowing if it's not specifically glowing, but probably more to fix the like actual tonality of your skin. That's my impression of whitening mask. I don't know. Next we have the Coscody Propolis uh, Blank Cell Mask. This is, I don't remember what this one is actually specifically supposed to do. Um, hold on. Um, heal and well nourish. Okay, clear and radiant. So this is a really good one for healing your skin. I love doing masks that are good for like healing your skin. Um, after like I've done like waxing like on my eyebrows, etc. Those are always really good for that. Next we have the Blooming Pink Cell Two Step Mask. Um, this one. What is this one supposed to do? It says skin peeling, so I'm assuming it's a skin peeling mask. Looks like it's got the two steps, so apparently there's, the, okay, the pink peeling toner and then the actual mask here. So it's always nice when a skin does like a, when you have a mask that does like a peeling and then you put the mask on. For those ones, I recommend like when you feel like your skin's kind of patchy, so you feel like the unevenness like with your fingers, not so much like it looks uneven, but you can actually feel it's uneven to the touch. So that's when I always recommend doing masks like that. Next we have the Tea Tree Fresh Forward. This is supposed to be a mask that's really good for all skin types really really gentle um, really good to like purify and soothe your skin another one to do after like waxing or if you got like weather beaten outside um, the next one is the Ellen Celia Intracell this is a mask that is um, it's like a snail mask I've done this one before I want to say it's really good for like making your skin feel really dewy and bouncy after um, it's got snail and caviar in it mm, all kinds of fancy stuff up in that one next one we have is the Vita cocktail foil mask um, it's like a brightening foil mask. That's basically it. I like the packaging on this one. Um, all right. Whew, that was, there was a lot. There's still so much more here. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep on going. Okay. Next we're gonna go through, I have a lot of different masks from BioBell, which they are also friends of mine. They've sent me some masks to try out before. I will say if you've never checked out BioBell, check them out. Not only do they have some of the best packaging on face masks, but their face masks are honestly incredible. Like I've gotten helicopter mom hooked on BioBell. Like she's always checking the website now. Like, hey, BioBell got any sales going on? I don't know. She's like got the little BioBell face mask itch. But honestly, their, their sheet masks, they don't irritate the skin. So my mom has really, really um, sensitive skin. They don't irritate it, but also they just do like amazing things for it. So the first one I have from them is the Happy Hour Red Wine Mask. This one's really good for minimizing aging. Again, the packaging is just adorable. Um, the Stay Gorgeous Mask Hydrates and Nourishes. You can usually find these on Ulta's website as well as BioBell's website directly. Um, and this one has almond oil and vitamin E. I want to say something people are always worried because I'm allergic to almonds. I'm allergic to eating almonds, not almonds on my skin. So I just feel like I should say that. This one is the Beauty Scoop Mask. So this is avocado. Um, this one is really good for nourishing your skin. It's got collagen in it. I actually love, love, love the way that my skin feels every time I do that mask. The next one is the Dream Skin Mask. This one um, is really great 
for cleansing, toning, and moisturizing your skin. Um, we got the Perfect Radiance Mask here. This one is chocolate and mulberry in it. Again, the packaging, like, seriously so stinking cute. And we have the um, Hydrogel Black Lace Glam Mask. This one is really good for purifying and refining your pores and actually does supposedly look like this black lace on there. So those are from BioBell. Like I said, they've sent me masks to try out before. I love them. Their brand is phenomenal. Their masks, like, they're clean. They're good. They're wonderful. So check them out if you haven't. And again, 23 years old, friends of mine as well, they have sent me masks to try out. I love them. Their brand is phenomenal. I, I have yet to try a mask from either of these brands that I do not absolutely love and fall like head over heels for. Um, next we have this mask. This is like, I told you guys, it's like one of my holy grail masks. This is the J. John mask. This is a whitening mask. So the thing is, this is a three step. What I love about this is you do the mask, then it comes with like an all over like um, ampoui serum type product and then it has this eye cream. This eye cream seriously like it gets your eyes snatched like you will look so freaking amazing after you use that eye cream. I actually will keep it and I will like use it sparingly so I can use it for like three or four days morning and night because it's just like yes queen. Alright, next thing that we have is this Elixir Golden Face Mask here. Um, skin Refreshing Mask. I've done, I got two of these. I did this one once before. I really like it. It's really nice for like hydrating and glowing your skin. Kind of just on day where like my skin's a little bit dry today. What should I do? This is a really good mask for that. Alright, next we have a couple masks from Erno Laszlo. This is a Lighten and Brighten and this one is a Soothe and Calm. Honestly, any face masks from Erno Laszlo are absolutely amazing. Now, you can find a lot of these right now at TJ Maxx on clearance. They're normally very expensive and they're hydrogel girl. They seriously, ugh. The soothing and calming one, doing that one after you've like waxed is amazing. Any Erno Laszlo hydrogel mask is just like, yes, I got my life. The next one we have, okay, from that brand I Do Care, which I showed earlier, this is a double step mask. A double step. Okay, it's called double down two step mask. Um, so it's got an exfoliating peeling pad and then it's got the actual um, mask here, which is the brightening vitamin C complex. This is one again you want to do when your skin actually feels like it has texture issues going on on it. Okay, so next I'm really excited to show you these ones. These were, like, I told you that the brand 23 years old sent me some face masks to try. Um, they sent me some amazing new masks. I'm kind of freaking out. I'm trying to, like, hold out because they look so cool, but also at the same time I want to try them, and you can buy these on Amazon's website, so just check them out there. Okay, y'all, look at these masks. Okay, so this one is the Occupare um, petite mask. So this one comes with like this little eye cover here and then here it's got this part that you put up and you strap under your chin to like tighten your chin. I was like this is gonna get your girl into trouble. I'm excited. They have this cocktail velvet um, petite mask, which they sent me here. And they sent me this Hyotox, which is like a super like hydrating mask. Like I'm not even kidding it about how excited I am over the packaging. They also sent me um, this Cocoon Willow Silky Mask set here. They sent, so you guys have seen before that we've gotten like Cocoon Silk masks from them um, in like our face three boxes. So these are actually like Cocoon Willow Silk. These are different than the ones that they sent before. They're white packaging. And and I don't even know, but they sent me a box, and I'm, I'm like, I'm freaking out. So I'm really excited to try those ones out. Um, and then I have this box, so we're almost through the one side. We're almost through one side. It's been 20 minutes. I told you this video is going to be insane. Um, this here, which is the Jay John box set of masks. <laughs> One side! Ah! Um, and this one, I okay, so this one's exciting. I've used three of them, or two of them so far. It comes with five sheet masks. It comes with these, like, serum packets here, um, like this intense, like, black gold serum. And then it comes with the actual sheet masks in there. Okay, they're about to fall off of my lap, but I'm trying to keep some order here. So you do the sheet mask first. And then um, it's a gold snow black mask, which I should be doing them in this weather. And then you get the little serum packet. Okay, I'm trying to put this back away now. This is like troubling. Very, very troubling. All right, so that's one side. Okay, I think I'm going to like pause this to like put all these back in here and then we'll get to the other side. All right, I'm back. I had to like, whew, I had to drink some water. I was like, that wore me out going through half of this box. The good thing is this side, I think it's going to go faster because a lot of them are actually double, so I don't need to like go into as much detail as I did on this side of the box. Um, so on the front, we talked about the masks that were kind of like my, you know, eh masks. Um, so these are all like kind of doubles here. This is another one of the butterfly masks. Okay, these ones, I, these, these ones, this one I got at Target. 
on clearance. This is the Leaders Break Up With Your Ex Skin Cells face mask. I got it, not trying to throw shade. I just wanted my skin cells to be, my ex skin cells to be broken up with. Um, got the another one of the double uh, mask packs from... I do care. Um, this is, okay, so 23 years old, I told you I got masks on sale at um, Riley Rose. So I got the Black Caviar, another um, Black Caviar one, and then I have this one. It's a rose gold mask. Another one that covers up your whole face except for um, your nostrils. Another one of the baby face injection masks from Face Tree. I love this mask. Um, some more of the J. Jun masks. I told y'all that this is like my holy grail mask, so more of that one. Um, and then some more from BioBell. So we have the another dream skin another happy hour mask and another one of the glam um lace masks right there um and then i actually have a bio bell um box set which i haven't actually like opened yet i know that's kind of bad i guess we could open it now on here since i got it i just never actually opened it I recognize that I have a problem when it comes to sheet masks, but I also really love having, like, I don't know. So, this is the mask in here. I guess I should pull these out and we should take a little look at what we got in here. Jeez. So it's supposed to be like a little diary. Okay, we got the Stay Gorgeous mask, which is that one. We got this after party mask with Soothes and Brightens. I woke up like this mask. Um, this one, what does this one do? It's got Wild Rose and Vitamin C, Enhances Skin's Natural Glow. Another one of the Avocado Beauty Scoop Masks. Um, a Unicorn Glow Mask, love that one. And then another one of the Happy Hour Anti, or Minimize Signs of Aging Masks. I'm gonna put that away. As you can see, I have a lot of bio -Bell masks and 23 years old masks. I told you guys, like, seriously, and J. John, their face masks are amazing, like, for real. Like, and I'm not just saying that, like, the reason that, you know, I have so many is because they're fantastic. Like, they honestly, they're, they're ones that I, what I love is that I know I can trust that my skin is going to look and feel amazing after using them, and I don't have to worry about what's actually in them. All right, and then next we have a few more, or a couple more from Erno Laszlo. So we have another Lighten and Brighten, and then we have a Firm and Lift from Erno Laszlo. Um, okay, so that's actually pretty much it for my face mask, and now I'm going to put these back in here. What I'm going to show you is I have, like, I and lip care products like specifically um so already I'm trying to get in here the first thing that we have is like these true beauty gold foil lip masks that i got from like tj mask tj mask tj max wow i'm on a mask journey today um i like getting things like this um okay so honestly the these like little foil masks like sheet mask lip mask thingies that you can get um, at TJ Maxx, um, they're usually not like going to like plump or anything, but they will super hydrate and nourish your lips. So there's that factor. Um, I have this. It's a Patchology Wink and Kiss set. So um, you can usually get this um, at I think it's Macy's, and you get like eye patches and you get like lip patches, and usually you get like two of each in here. But these are always nice. Um, they're usually hydrogel. I like doing those ones um, when I need a little extra boost. And if you're ever wondering when do I do those so I like to do under eye patches usually just like once a week um, if I'm really feeling like my under eyes are looking tired I'll do it like twice a week I have this this is the yes to brand this is a two-step like um, to get rid of bags and dark circles for your under eyes um, I have all of these these are the skin Iceland um, eye gels so the thing I love about these is that these I'm I'm not even using like anywhere near like decent grammar right now. I accept that, but I I'm also acknowledging that. So these were recently on sale at Ulta. You'll actually find these usually during the um like beauty 21 days of beauty. They just had these 50% off. You get four of them for like when it's 50% off, it's like 750. It's like a limit of two because I tried to get more and they were like, You can't do it. And I was like, but I want more. Like we can't do it. I'm like, but it's the end of the day. No, it couldn't happen. So these I like because you put them under um, 
and they're cooling and they stick really well to your under eyes as well like they like adhere to your skin as well as like they make you look good so I like those for that reason I just got these last night at TJ's haven't tried them yet but these are like collagen um, hydrogel lip masks I think I got them just because they're pink probably don't actually do anything but they're pink so I got them for that reason um, next I have this one this is the night relaxing jelly eye mask got a bunch of these at Target on clearance this one was like a dollar 28 it's from clean and clear um, these are really good to wear at nighttime um, honestly I feel like sometimes like if my eyes are really really dry it almost like tingles a little bit more than I would appreciate but it's really good to like kind of like help you know help your problems um, next we have and then this actually oh this is it this is, oh wait, no, I'm just kidding. There's like one more thing down there. Um, this is the Star Skin Beauty. They sent us this um, for our feet. It's like a feet mask thingy. Haven't tried it yet, but, you know, excited to. Okay, there's like one more thing that fell to the bottom of this box. I'm trying to like pull it out without caving the integrity of this box. It's actually a couple of things down there. We're not even getting into that. This pumpkin mask. So this is like really weird. This is like a pumpkin mask. Um, first off, it does not smell great. I've done one of these before. But the thing about this is got these tiny little pumpkins and you just like stick them all over your face. And that's it. You're supposed to like keep these little pumpkins everywhere. I really am not a fan of it. But I had already gotten more than one. So it was like I already have it. But maybe I'll let the girls play with them sometime. I'll put that up here in the you can play with that mask um, pile. So this is pretty much like everything in my like sheet mask collection. Like I said, I have an entire dresser drawer with like not sheet masks. So if you're like, I would like to see that too. I could make a part two of this video. Um, I get face masks kind of regularly. Um, I just, the thing is, it's like this is a collection that I've been building over time. This didn't just happen overnight. I do get a monthly subscription box as well. Um, and I do usually get them at a fairly good price as well as, like I said, I have partnered with a couple of brands where they've sent me um, some masks to try out um, on, you know, like for Instagram and YouTube and all that, which is like BioWell and 23 years old. So I love those brands. Um, and anytime I can find anything on sale or if there's a like company doing like a face mask sale, I usually buy them. Um, um, so this is my mask box. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if not, sorry. People wanted me to do it. I don't know. But I, I mean, I had fun doing it because, you know, you guys kind of said before, like, what is actually in the box? So that's what's in the box. Um, I do get face masks, like I said, here and there. I've been trying to actually slow down and just cut back a little bit, but the odds are probably still gonna get a couple more this week because that's just kind of how it goes lately um and when I do get new skincare stuff I usually post about it on Instagram as well as I post fairly regularly whenever I do a sheet mask I usually post on my Instagram stories like which mask I'm doing that day so if you're ever like I want to know which mask she does like every day um you can check on there and then you can see like oh she does hydration masks on these days whatever I don't know okay so that's all I have for you guys today but if you want to see more photos of me you can check me out on Instagram Snapchat and on Twitter at just like Drew, spell the same way as down below. If you want to be part of the Just Like Drew crew and you're not already, click the red subscribe button down below this video and join our forever family because we are literally the best crew on with anybody and everybody can be in our crew. I love you guys so so much. And if you like this video and you want to see more from me, you know what to do. Just like Drew, have an amazing day, have an amazing week, have an amazing life, and I will talk to you very, very soon for a new some kind of video. All right, talk to you. Love you. Goodbye. 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 I just they just have to be right. That was our yeah. problem. Yeah. Yeah, because normally, like when I have done it before, how much like, are Cut around. Uh, no, it's like they were on sale. It was like seventy nine cents. Where? Only. At Woodman's. That was a lot of stuff.